The head of New York City Transit rode the subway for his first day on the job. Andy Byford has run uh, transit systems in Sydney, London, and most recently in Toronto. He will now take charge of New York City's transit authority, subways, buses, paratransit services, and the Staten Island Railway. Eyewitness News reporter Tim Fleischer is live in Lower Manhattan with more on the new president's priorities. Tim. And you could say, and you could call it a new day here at the MTA. The new president coming to work for the first day, coming right out of the subway system here, which he will be in charge of. He is also promising some very big changes. This is a dream come true for me, uh, but I haven't come here to be a tourist. I've come here to get a job done. And with that, Andy Byford is setting his sights on making many improvements to the vast 24-7 subway and bus system as the new MTA president. First priority for me is to do what customers need, want and deserve, and that is to provide clean, punctual, reliable, uh, friendly and, and overall most important safe service. And he plans to see it firsthand. Emerging from the subway on his way to his first day at work, Byford clearly leads by example. I've never owned a car in my life. I don't intend to buy a car here, uh, so I will be riding the system every day. Uh, I'm, I'm going to make a point of riding buses as well as subway, actually. Byford began his career as a station foreman in London's underground system and left the Toronto system to come to New York. Another priority is to focus on employee morale, performance and development. He's expecting MTA workers to up their game. The new president is also anxious to meet with city officials.